Hi everybody, uh, welcome back to IT Sligo where we're joined by one of our Canadian students, Claire Tonello. And Claire, uh, for the benefit of people watching in, uh, could you clarify or explain which program and from which institution you transferred to IT Sligo from Canada? Yes, yeah, so I was um, an advanced biotechnology student at Algonquin College in Ottawa and I heard about this program in March and it just seemed like an amazing opportunity compared to the pathways that were available at home. So I made the jump and I, I, it's the best decision I've ever made. So you've transferred directly into the fourth and final year of our BSc Honours in Medical Biotechnology. Yeah, that's correct and I'm loving it. It's such a great program so far. The labs, everything is just, it's just excellent. Yeah. Uh, so why did you choose to come to IT Sligo and Ireland uh, as opposed to staying back home in Canada and availing of some domestic degree completion pathway options? Well, first of all, um, just the time that it would take to finish my degree in the first place. Like most places that I looked into in Canada, it's two to three years to finish your degree. Um, second of all, the fact that I get to come to a foreign country and it's Ireland at that, like you can't get much better than that. And then the cost, like you can use your OSAP to come here, which is extremely helpful and it's... It's reduced tuition for international students too, I believe, or from, from Ontario colleges. So it's in the long run, it's much cheaper to come here than it is to stay at home. So you applied through the IT Sligo in-market representative office, KOM Consultants, based in Hamilton. How did you find that process? Um, I found it really, they were very easy to work with. It was a few quick emails. I filled out the application form and then boom, it was done. I had my uh, letter of acceptance and it was, it was done. It was maybe a two week process in total. And did they charge an application fee to you? Um, I don't think so, no. I only paid the, tu the tuition deposit and that was it. So how are you settling into student life in Sligo and in Ireland? Sligo in general is, is amazing. Like first, I had never heard of it before I researched this program and I'm glad I came because it, everything about it is great. It's such, it feels like you're on a movie set. It's so pretty and then the nightlife is amazing. The food is good. The people are friendly. I really, I can't, I can't say anything bad about it to be honest with you. And do you have any plans to travel um, during the academic calendar or certainly during break time? Yes, my, uh, my roommates and I are planning to go to Amsterdam in the spring. Um, I've been around the country a little bit. I went to the Cliffs of Moher and Doolin and did some touring there. I was just in Dublin on the weekend and going back over the break. So it's so easy to get around as well. Like the public transportation compared to Canada is it's, it's amazing. So if you had any words of advice or pearls of wisdom to give to any prospective students thinking of applying to IT Sligo uh, for fall 2019, uh, what would they be? Um, go for it, make the jump. It's, it's, it's scary at first, but it's the best decision you'll ever make by far. Okay guys, um, thank you so much Claire for your time thank and you. for any prospective students thinking of applying to IT Sligo, you heard Claire, jump on the komconsultants.com website, register your details there. It's free to apply and you'll save time. You can use OSAP. Um, you don't need a student study visa to come to Ireland if you're a Canadian citizen. So plenty of reasons to choose IT Sligo and to choose Ireland. Absolutely. Thanks, Claire. Thank you.